We've got the teams here at the Google Field, and they are amazing. It'll be the number one alliance on the Red Alliance side of the field, taking on the number nine alliance there from Spirit. Let's introduce our teams. In the number one position on the red side of the field, team nine, 17C as in Zebra, Pum Tom Zima. Their alliance partner hails from Chinese Taipei. They are team number 980S as in Sierra. It's Skywalker. On the blue side of the field, proudly representing the Spirit Division, the alliance captain, number 2011 Alpha from Broadville Heights, Ohio, Asymmetrical! And their alliance partner, the pride of Montclair, Virginia, Team 80, 78 X-Ray, it's the Exobites! Science versus Spirit. Teams are in position. Referees have given their okay. We begin this match in three, two, one, go. 15 seconds of autonomous operation begins now. Blue Alliance coming out quickly. They've got the opening and we begin driver controlled in three, two, one, go. Blue Alliance again with the uh, advantage. We begin driver control in three, two, one, go. Minute 45 on the clock as he skillful drivers bring their robots out onto the field. 136. Red Alliance in possession of three of the mobile goals. Blue Alliance has four. Near side of the field, plenty of action. Blue Alliance is on the move. That's the Exobites on the near side. Now they move back down to the forward side of the field. Back and forth they go. Blue Alliance trying to make it happen now. Looking for an opening so they can steal away a one of the mobile goals. Red Alliance has dropped their two goals. And it's gonna be Quantum Zima out on the loose. Less than a minute remaining. Quantum Zima moves in, attacking the Blue Alliance. Trying to grab one of those mobile goals. They back away now. Making their way back down to the other end, trying to grab another one. Quantum Zima all over the field. In the meantime, the team from Chinese Taipei with two mobile goals in their possession. Lining up now, getting ready. Blue Alliance already on the platform. One of their robots fully elevated. Platform is balanced. They have two of the mobile goals in their possession. Alliance partner trying to add another one. 13 seconds left. It all comes down to this. Red Alliance trying to get elevated on the platform. Attempting a double climb. They've got it. With one, two mobile goals. The third one falls off just as time expires unbelievable match play brad this is incredible what did you see i saw some tipping point man that's what this game is all about i mean we yeah every match is gonna be crazy i'm gonna i'm gonna stop saying how incredible these matches are um, instead to help me talk about how incredible these matches are i'm here with Vonch from the vex man Vonch. How are you doing today? Doing pretty good, man. Um, competition's been pretty crazy, so <laughs> it's fun watching these matches, um, even though we lost. But <laughs> Even though you got to have the front seat, the best seat in the house right. for these matches. That's how it oh, went, yeah. right? Great. So what was your role on the Vexmen this year? Um, so I was one of the builders and a sh uh, strategist. One of the and, strategy people? Yep, as well as scouting um, for our team, as far as alliances go and all that. So. 
So when it comes to strategy in this game, you know, as the lead strategist, I mean, wh what's your take? What, what's the way to play? Um, so some of the things we emphasize, especially in our notebook and our design, are uh, we want to hold the yellow goals. Obviously, um, the neutral goals, they make all the difference in the match. So that's exactly what we try to keep um, possession of. And that's our, like, that's our whole thing we go by in matches. We want to focus, make sure if you get the yellow goal, you hold on to it. Um, because from past experience, we've learned that it can always change the matchup a little bit. Oh, it totally can, yeah. So in this case, so there was an interesting like di dichotomy in the strategies here. Right. One alliance went for the single park, one went for the double park. Um, what was your take on that? Like, why do you think they made that call? What, like, would you have made the same call? Yeah, um, yeah I think it was the right call, uh, just because for us at least, um, if our alliance has one goal and we have two, we like to always go for the double park. Okay. Um, but if we have one goal, all right, if we have two goals and they have two goals, then we just keep with it. So I think they made the right decision. Excellent. Well, let's find out if they made the right decision. Tyler, do we have scores ready? The score is 80 to 235 for the Blue Alliance. Spirit Division advances. Wow. All right, Stephanie, who do we have playing next at the Northrop Grumman Field?